and girls and again we're just covering knots today and uh, today I want to show specifically the figure of eight knot one of the most popular knots we use for tying monofluorocarbon to a hook or a swivel okay very simple for the purpose of, of the illustration I'm using braided line so you can see it better and I'll do it with a thicker line as well and also very simple you put it through the eye of the hook I use my index finger where I will loop it twice over back towards the hook. Then I would remove the loops from my finger and from the hook upwards away from the hook you'll stick it through both loops and it will form that figure of eight. This is also a knot that pulls down on itself. Okay, so you can pull it nice and tight there from the tag end. Remember to lubricate the knots before you pull them tight. And then this knot slips down to the hook. You pull it as tight as you can and then you pull the tag end. All right, now I'm going to do exactly the same for you guys using a thicker rope so you can see it clearly. All right, as I said, here's the ring of your hook or your swivel. You'll stick your line straight through, very simple. You'll make the two loops going back towards the hook. All right, I use my index finger and you'll run one, two, like that. You'll remove the loops off your finger. And you'll stick it from the hook away from the hook. It forms that figure of eight like that. You pull it tight on that. You'll see it forms exactly nicely packed to two lines or strings and then it will slip down to your hook and that you pull very tight on your long end and then on your tag end. Remember again to lubricate the knot before you pull it tight.